Hi everyone, in this video we are going to talk about how to tell the difference between blasts and lymphocytes. So here we have some myeloblasts. As you can see, myeloblasts have a very high nuclear to cytoplasmic ratio. Most of these cells you can hardly see the cytoplasm. The chromatin pattern really stands out to me. As you can see, it's quite fine. I like to think of it as a little bit lacy, a little bit watery. And you can also get uh, nucleoli. The one over on the right here has some about two or so prominent nucleoli. The one at the very top here has got a little pale patch and that is very standard of myeloblasts. We have some more here. Again, high NC ratio, very fine lacy chromatin pattern, scanty cytoplasm. It can sometimes be very basophilic. These ones aren't too basophilic. And the nucleus is often round or a little bit overly. Again, here's some more myeloblasts. These nucleoli are a bit more prominent, a bit more obvious, high NC ratio, scanty cytoplasm, and very fine chromatin pattern. Lymphocytes, you can have small lymphocytes and large lymphocytes. Here in the center we have a small lymphocyte. You can see the nuclear to cytoplasmic ratio is almost a 2 to 1. The nucleus is round and the chromatin pattern is quite dense. Here we have some small lymphocytes. The nucleus can be round or oval and is usually a 2 to 1 ratio. It can be slightly indented, like the one on the left here. And the chromatin pattern is what really stands out here. It's quite coarse and clumped and a little bit patchy in some areas. The cytoplasm can be sky blue to a deeper blue, as you can see. And there's no granules in small lymphocytes. Here's some larger lymphocytes. As you can see, they're significantly bigger than our small lymphocytes. The chromatin pattern is what really stands out here. It's very coarse and clumped. Got some scanty cytoplasm again, and it's a sky blue color. The NC ratio is normally a 4 to 1. This one looks a little bit tricky, but this is a atypical lymphocyte. They're usually quite large and the very deeply basophilic cytoplasm. Often these can get mistaken for blasts, but as you can see, the chromatin pattern is quite dense and the NC ratio is just not high enough for it to be a blast. So we've got some blasts and lymphocytes side by side. So as I was saying before, if you look at the chromatin pattern, it's very smooth and lacy compared to the lymphocyte here over on the right. And the NC ratio, you've got a lot more cytoplasm on the lymphocyte than you do on the blast on the left. So now you have a go. What do you think this is? If you guess lymphocyte, then you're correct. And have a go again. What do you think each of these cells are? If you guess lymphocyte, lymphocyte blasts, then you are correct. I hope this video was helpful and thank you for tuning in.